Look at, at all these photos. They were posted by people desperate to get rid of their cold source. Two of them are here today. First up is Stephanie, who's joining us very bravely. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Now, I understand you're actually going through a cold source belt. I am. It's that one right there. <laughs> That's one. Can you show it, show it on camera? Let's put that camera right there and show it to everybody. This one. Sort of see that. It's, well, it's getting better. I know they can be painful. They're often embarrassing. So, they are. You know, thank you for coming on. Give her an applause for that. That's, me. That's what it's about. All right. Come on back. I'm going to show you what that tingle that we often get is from. That's the worst part. Is that the worst part? It is the worst part. Because you know it's coming. I know. And I know it's coming, but no one else does. So, like, I feel it, and I just want to itch it, and you just have to tell yourself, like, no, don't itch it. Yeah. That's the worst. So what are your triggers? For me, it's the sun. And I heard that that was a breeding it ground for cold Absolutely. Cold. In fact, coming up here, I'm going to meet a colleague, another woman who's frustrated with her source. Teresa is joining us. How are you? Hi, how are you? So we just heard that sun is an important trigger for Stephanie. What's, what's the trigger for your cold source? Um, definitely for me it's stress because um, I work about 60 hours a week. I'm an IT consultant for Samsung. So I work with the public and electronics, so stress out all the time. Right. Those are the two big ones. And by the way, there are three headbands here on purpose because there are many other kinds of potential causes as well, but the third one that we haven't mentioned yet is illness. So I want each of you to, to choose your headband that reflects your problems. You've got sun over there. You take stress. I'll take illness. That's totally that's, for me. that's Don. Okay, can you all see our stressors? Perfect. Now, the question is, what can you do about cold sores? It turns out that you can stop cold sores in their tracks. Teach me. You did, right? Yeah, tell me. <laughs> right everyone, and I say, I'm so fascinated. Now, not I know this is out there that everyone doesn't already do this. But I've got the one thing that I really think is going to help a lot of folks. Because it can literally help you save your face. So how does it help stop the cold sores in its tracks? Well, all right. So I wanted to transform us into a cold sore train. Remember soul train? This is cold train. So put, put your shoulder there. You gotta yeah. choo -choo -choo. Let's get the train going. I'm going to lead. You're the quietest train. Now, we're coming over to the tracks here. The tracks are the life cycle of the virus. We'll stop cold stores in their tracks. It does a couple things. It prevents them from getting larger. So even if the tingling happens, it can be a bit smaller. It also can reduce the number of blisters in the cold sore, both of which are good things. So that's the first thing. Okay, come back on. Make some noise back there. We get to a detour. It's detour off the track, the regular track that normally would have taken 10 days. We can shorten the duration dramatically because it actually affects pretty much how the virus propagates. Studied in many trials and it's shown to do this, which again, I don't know why we're all not using it right now. If you've got cold sores, if you have a friend that's got them, Put it on your Facebook. Make sure everyone knows this is how you treat these, these things when they happen. And finally, we're coming to the station. Coming to the station. And look what happened. Next train is canceled. Why is the next train canceled? And will actually help prevent cold sore viruses from invading your face in the first place. So then send me your notes when you do this and you've cured yourselves. I want to know how well it works for you as well. We'll be right back.